IMA has learned a new gang has infiltrated the Yakima County Jail. The Pisces have become a real problem for jail officers because they don't have a signature. That makes them harder to identify. So could a problem on the inside mean a problem on the outside for you? Well, Heather Walker spoke to a self-proclaimed Pisces member to find out the answer. <laughs> Officers have seen Serenios, Norteños, Bloods, Crips, and white supremacists for years. They started noticing a new gang. Paisa is basically a Mexican gang that started out as the anti-gang. People joined against the gangs. That's how officers here say their membership grew. The problem officers have with Paisas is there's no color or symbol associated with the gang. Officers say they've grown into a dangerous gang. Hello, this is a prepaid collect call from Paisa 16. This call and your telephone number will be monitored and recorded. Let's go. Uh, Thomas Murder, come kill time for your lockdown quarantine. We got lockdown stories from prison and also stories from the free world outside. So today I want to talk about, I want to speak on paisas. Uh, paisa is just a short word for paisano, and which means hometown, home country, man. Um, so that's... That's the way you call somebody from your same home home country. Like, hey, what's up, hometown homeboy? It's like saying, what's up, buddy? You know, what's up, Paisa? And that's just what it is. And uh, the, this this group, though, they're they're and they're almost in every jail, county jail, and in prison in the United States, and even in some in Mexico. And but the. Uh, they were made mostly just, it was just uh, people from originally from Mexico, people that was born in Mexico coming together and grouping each other to like help each other out with commissary, with uh, against the other groups that wanted to extort them and stuff. But most, most county jails and most prisons, they will have like, they will have pi groups of paisas. And some some might be more organized than others. If you go to high security prisons or gang prisons, and they and they have pices there, uh, most likely they they are rocking tattoos with the number sixteen, the Made in Mexico eagle. But for the most part, pices don't wear tattoos. If you if you go to almost any federal county in in the U.S. and they got pices, and they see you got a lot of tattoos, they're gonna try to check you. And they will try to like see what kind of tattoos you got if they're gang related, and they might like green light green light you and may uh, ship you out of the tank, ship you out of wherever you you're at, and you know because of fear that you might be an enemy, Pisces, uh, and they are on a sometimes on high security units they're on an ongoing war with the Azteca, the Barrio Azteca, and also. Was the other gang, the Mara Salvatrucha, but it's mostly the Aztecas. And, uh, but you have this other group that I was talking about on my last video, the PRMs, which are also known as Paisas and Mexicles. And Mexicle is just a slang word for, for Mexican. So, they also use this eagle right here, the Made, the made in Mexico eagle. And they also call each other Paisa sometimes, uh, but their force is in the in city of Juarez, and the the sister city with El Paso, Texas, and the border of Mexico. You have a lot of Mexicans there, and they actually run half of the prison over there in the city of Juarez. So you got the you got this PRM gang, and you got the Paisas. A lot of people confuse these two. Especially in the feds, um, and when and, they, and then I wanted to speak on Texas as well because that's where I did my time at. I did two years in the uh, ID high security unit, and Paisas are Tango in Texas, and they call them Tango Mexicles. I guess this is because to separate them from the other Mexicles. Um, they also use the 16. They carry out disciplines, missions, green lights. Uh, they 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 take care of you if you're a, if you're from Mexico, you know they try to get you. You gotta put in work, but they'll try to get you commissary. They'll try to get you straight with uh, your hygiene and shit, and hygiene and stuff. 
So yeah, um, this is Pisces 16, y'all. Welcome to the channel. Hit that like button. Make sure y'all subscribe and share the content. That way we could grow and make this platform bigger. Anyways, coming back to the Pisces. They're just a group from Mexico. And then you do have some groups that are from Honduras or from El Salvador or from Guatemala. From another third world country like Colombia or something. But they're mostly from Mexico and they will they would just speak spanish most of them and i seen this black dude he used to run with us the paisas but he was born in mexico and he spoke a lot of spanish and he had done 15 years in the mexican prison this was when i was locked up in el paso county but yeah um the word tango just stands for together against negative gang organizations i guess that's why paisas are tango in texas prison but they that doesn't have to do anything with uh with them being like a, organiza a criminal organization. It's just a, a prison group that you join in prison. And when you come out, you, you decide what you want to do. So anyway, that's five minutes in on the video. Just wanted to speak a little bit on Pisces. I, I hope everybody is, having a, is going to have a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. Y'all make sure to subscribe if you haven't yet. Pisces 16, time is murder. Come kill time. Appreciate it.